Ähm, ich bin jetzt gerade auf dem Weg zu dem Artwork von Chris. Das möchte ich euch einmal zeigen, wie es am Ende aussieht. Außerdem war ich neulich in dem Mediziner Clothing Store und habe da die beiden Betreiber und Besitzer kennengelernt, die das Ganze jetzt schon seit zwölf Jahren machen. Ein mega geiler kleiner Shop, der genauso gut in Berlin-Kreuzberg oder in Köln-Ehrenfeld sein könnte. Äh, mega nette Typen, super gute Klamotten, haben mich äh, direkt ausgestattet mit T-Shirts, wie zum Beispiel mit diesen hier. Und ähm, ja, was wir da gemacht haben, zeige ich euch jetzt mal. What made you start out in the first place? The first, the first place we started out because we didn't have anywhere to play. No bars would let us play. I wouldn't figure out would be selling shirts or living off of putting up trolls or or organizing trolls. I wouldn't think of that. I was the I was the last person you'd think of organizing things like this. Been doing this for 12 years, but from the start we, uh, when we were starting out, we were, we were, there were a lot of resistance to it. At one point in my life, uh, my parents left the States and I decided to stay. I chose my band over them. Yeah. So uh, I, I had no money. I was running out of money. I was almost kicked out of my house, but before they got to kick me out, I decided to live with my friend. And that happens to be Toots. So everything we thought about, we just followed through. But Amitiba was born and Medicina Clothing was born. Uh, we kind of thought that If we had an event, we could promote the shirt, and if we had the shirt, we could promote the event. Yeah. You, have, you have two stores, you have, I mean... The hot sauce? I, I mean, I have to show this, they have their own hot sauce. No matter what the haters say, that's breakfast, dude. Come on. 